Rebecca, do you use coupons when you shop? You know what? I don't. And I know what? your wife does, and she's really good at it. She's, I need to learn. She does her research, and she really knows how to save money by knowing that there's a cheaper price here, and that yeah. maybe you can take that price to this guy, and he'll yeah. match it. It's she'll really save good. receipts to like go and do all that stuff. She does. Yes. She'll take stuff back right. if she finds it goes on sale. Right. Anyway, anyway, we're going we're gonna to talk all about this. We're going to talk about price matching, and we're going to get tips by the author of Create Your Own Money Adventure, Malia Johnson, who is joining us to talk all about Welcome. it. Hi, Malia. Hi. So I'm a total <laughs> She's looking at me very geek. disappointed. Mm, <laughs> no. you. I have things to teach you. So talk to us a little bit about just traditional coupons and couponing, Malia. Right. I know there was that huge couponing craze a few years ago when everyone was going crazy trying to coupon. It takes a lot of work, and sometimes people don't have time. They don't want to clip the coupons. They don't want to organize the coupons. Obviously, it's the best way to save if you're going to combine a coupon with you know, like a, a deal in a store, that's the best way to say it, but not everyone has time to do that. Mm -hmm. So I also want to talk about price matching too, because price matching is a great way to save money without having to clip coupons. And just like your wife, it's like a great way to save money and not have to go all over town to get the same deal. Will what you, is price sorry, matching? Yeah, what is price matching? So price matching is basically you'll take an ad, like the ads I have here, uh -huh. and you'll see what deals other stores have. And you'll okay. take it to Walmart or you'll take it to Target and say, I want these same deals and I want the same prices for the exact same item and they'll price match them for you yeah. right on the spot. So really? instead of having to go like five or six grocery stores to get all the best deals, you can go to one place and get all the same deals at the great price. How do you know if somebody has price matching at their store? Will everybody do it across right. the board? Not everybody will, but first of all, it doesn't hurt to ask. And second of all, big stores like Walmart and Target have an actual price matching policy. So you can just look at that online and see what they won't and what they will do, and you can print it off and take it with you if you need it. But that way you know that those two stores are good to go for sure. Mm -hmm. And then you know other stores like Best Buy or electronic stores, they're all going to price match too. What about e-coupons? E-coupons are great. How yes. do you get those? What do you do? Um, like if you have a Kroger store, Kroger uh -huh. store has their own, no matter what affiliated store it is, they have their own e-coupons you get online. You clip you know, with your mouse which coupons you want, and they go right to your shopper's values card. So when you get to checkout, you scan it, and all those coupons come off your bill. No clipping involved. See, that's easy. Yeah, and it that's only nice. takes and it only takes about I would say two minutes to do it on your computer before you leave to go shopping. Wow. Uh, yeah. What is your feeling on like club cards at grocery stores? Because I have the sense when I go to the grocery store that I only buy stuff that is on the club card sale. Like, look, with your card, it's only mm -hmm. two dollars. I grab that stuff. Am I really saving money, or is the store just pushing me towards the things it wants me to buy? Well, they are doing that because they're promoting something. But I would stack as many saving possibilities as possible. So you're going to want to stack your coupon. You're going to stack your, stack your price matching tools, stack any e-coupons you have, and then whatever sales. You're never going to save money if you're buying the full price item with a coupon. You always want to buy the sale items, like you said with a coupon, and then mm. you'll save the most. What about shopping the aisles? Like, how to shop the aisles in a store? Yeah, okay, so this is one of my tips, and Target is one of my favorite places to shop. I love the vibe there, love the deals, but one of the best places to go is actually on the back end of the aisle. It's like the inner end cap. So it's like against the back wall where you wouldn't normally walk, it's where all of the, oh, it's so great, I love it. All the <laughs> clearance signs, 70% off, 30% off on food, housewares, everything. It's all back there and you just, oh, you can just use them and you can use a coupon if you wanted to to drop the price even more. Wow. That's amazing. Thank, Thank you, Thank you so much yeah. for this information. Thank you. You'll save money by picking up a copy of her book, Create Your Own Money Adventure.